Hello everybody, I'm forecaster Dustin Staples here with you on this Sunday. Merry Christmas Eve to you all out there. We're getting ready for the big day. Of course, I recently had a chance to talk uh, with the uh, Santa and his helper said he should be arriving in North Carolina between 930 and 11 uh, this evening. So you still got plenty of time uh, to make the good list as they say out there. So listen to parents folks and have a good day. Enjoying it for sure too. staying mild and dry, looking pretty warm for Christmas out here too. And the good news is that we're not staying as cold as we were yesterday uh, morning about this time there. You kind of see here our temperatures are in the 30s and mostly some 40s across our map uh, regions there. So really not too bad of a forecast as we're speaking to you right there too. Very dry air is at place here, but the good news is this dry air is going to stay around preventing any moisture from coming in our backyards. Kind of see the sun starting to come up there towards New Bern as you're doing any shopping. Maybe today, of course, it is Sunday, so maybe some things may not be as open as they usually are, but of course, if you have to go to any of the uh, the big name stores out there today. Just be careful. Members take it slow and easy. If you're traveling out anywhere too, uh, you may watch out for a lot of delays. Of course, pay attention to airlines. Very busy across the skies as well. And of course, you may end up seeing some reindeer flying across the sky, depending on where you're going. But if you're staying here in the States, you should be good to go as you're out and about. Radar is pretty quiet right now. Really not much going on here in the east. This is our weather maker that's going to eventually move its way across to our area as we go closer into two Tuesday and Wednesday. Right now, the models continue to hold off on this storm, showcasing more of a later Tuesday afternoon than a Wednesday event now. So we're continuing to keep a close eye on that. Folks are going to out towards uh, Nebraska, parts of uh, Colorado here. We're going to have a nice white Christmas Eve. And of course, it's going to be cold enough for them to stay uh, a lot of snow out towards that region. So that's where the snow is going to be staying. No snow here, no rain tomorrow. Looking pretty nice as you're doing anything out and about today. A bit to upper 60s or a forecast friends today. Of course, as you're getting ready to go to bed as uh, Santa's coming to town later this evening, looking pretty good for him. We're going to be setting temperatures in the 40s out here, mostly to partly cloudy skies overnight. Tomorrow morning, we'll wake up to a few clouds. Some of these uh, computer models may show a little more aggressive, but again, I do believe we'll see a few breaks of sunny skies in between maybe a few isolated sprinkles along our coastal communities. But generally speaking, there we go. See, there's a blend of sunshine and clouds between Greenville, Williamston and Windsor. Other than that, in most areas will be a partly to mostly cloudy day, and that is because we have our storm system kind of approaching our doorstep as we go closer to this right here, too. So Monday's outlook, kind of see here, we're going to stay pretty dry for Monday, and of course the wet weather is going to stay well out uh, to our western part of the state there as Santa's going to be arriving, bringing some nice weather in his present sack, to say the least. So we'll time this out here for you. Pretty nice Monday. Really nothing's going to be hindering. Clouds will be out there at times as well, and again, over Overnight Monday, this is where we start to see the storm system start to move in. Here we are still. Some of you may be lucked out by 9, 10 o'clock on Tuesday morning, not seeing anything falling. But again, midday and late evening is the best opportunity to see any rainfall to pick up here uh, in our rainfall uh, forecast here. Coastal communities here north of Greenville, outside of uh, Camden and Washington, Terrell counties, the Cape Hatteras region there north of that. We'll see rain showers give or take until after sunrise, and then most areas will eventually kind of clear out once all is said and done. Still on target for about a half an inch to maybe an inch in some of your backyards. A good soaking rain for us. Again, we are doing well with our drought with the rain that we saw the last several weekends. That is what we're seeing with that too. But again, as Santa's coming to town tonight, unfortunately, no snow. We're going to be clear with, as we can see with clouds coming in play. 40 degrees. He may be flying with uh, flip flops and uh, probably some shorts on because he's used to the cold and this is going to feel pretty nice to him as he's coming here to Eastern Carolina. But today, pretty nice generally sunny skies, mid 60s, maybe a few upper 60s out there from time to time. Lows tonight fall in the upper 30s and low to the 40s for most of your readings there. And again, over the next several days, of course, turning breezy as we go closer into Monday. Tuesday, we'll see breezy windy conditions at times too. Mid 60s, we've kind of left our high temperature there uh, as more cloud cover is going to be holding on. We may not get near 70, but it's going to be very few isolated spots that do on Monday. And then we'll start to see things clearing out as we go through Thursday into the upcoming New Year's weekend. Right now we're seeing a cold snap come our way as we get closer, wrapping up the end of the year, maybe turning much uh, cooler going into the first half of 2024.